ran into a typhoon in Japan, and uh, my umbrella didn't didn't make it. Right there. You remember which one it is? Yep, it's the black one. <laughs> there we go. Is that good? There we go. Tomorrow, stay connected. What's up, man? Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Okay, we good. <laughs> For the, uh, the Kazakhstan team, just uh, getting changed over there in the corner. Big crew. Seems like a lot of different countries are represented here today. We've got Singapore, I know, is here. Korea, obviously Japan. Here's Kazakhstan. So it's going to be a battle. It is super busy, huh? Wow, a lot of people. A lot of, a lot of wet people. Ready? Very nice, ah, Shaolin. Uh, How's it good. going, man? Doing really well. Good Thank to you. see you. Good to see you, too. Good to see you too. Ready for the uh, super fight tomorrow? Yeah. yeah. Excited? I'm excited. I already make my weight, so all good. So ready for eat and rest a little bit. Always good to fight here in Japan too, yeah, right? Amazing. I think this is what this is like a number 12 or 13 or something like that. So it'd be it'd be great to be you know, competing here again. It's a beautiful arena. Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. How's it going? Oh, good. Just finalized few of the little things now, the less details. Yeah, we were ready now. It's the four fifth, so we have a lot of experience now to avoid the mistakes. That's why now. It's like a symphony. Everyone is working together. It's the fourth fifth. Good experience. So I believe we start sharp tomorrow. Well, the arena looks absolutely beautiful. The guys are just putting the finishing touches on it. But I gotta say, with the athletes, it's absolutely chaos. There are just so many guys weighing in. How's it going, Alex? Hey, how are you, bro? Good to see you again. Busy today? Yeah, sure, sure. Can you explain uh, what it is you're doing right now? I am informing people that their geese are illegal uh, for tomorrow and making them dislike me, probably. But um, I'm going to make tell them this, and then tomorrow someone else will make the decision, and um, at least they will be prepared and know in advance. We'll see how we go. This guy. Look at this guy. Oh, you've got the guns out. Yeah, my fed guns. All ready to go? Weighed in? Yeah, all, all weighed in, ready to go. Had a nice roll. Now we're going to go and eat. You've already been training today as well, huh? Just a roll. I wouldn't say training. Just sweating. But ready to go tomorrow? Yeah, I can't wait. Excited? We're good. Can get that money? I know. Money. I don't have to cut to 49 Sorry. kilos. Oh. I feel good. I feel great. Strong. Hydrating? Yes, hydrating after weigh-in. Did no you have matter, to lose weight? Yeah, no matter what my weight class is, somehow, some way, I have to lose weight. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's good to see you back at 85. Yeah, I belong at 85. I should be at 77, but um, I feel I feel good at 85. I like 85 right Strong, now. Strong, right? Yeah, yeah. I gotta avenge my my own jujitsu after after that ugly match. I forced you guys to watch with Craig Jones last time, so I'm I'm, I'm looking on to put on a show. So it'll be much better tomorrow. Jake McKenzie, What's going on, man? good to see you, dude. How are you? Just chilling, all weighed in, ready to go for tomorrow. Oh, awesome! 77 kilos, you excited? 77 kilos, super excited. I'm definitely gonna invest in the UAE. I had a really good time with the World Pro, and I think they're doing a really good job with the events. Um, and I wanted to be out here in Japan to do the first one for the year. I'm gonna try to do all of them this year for sure. Ah, okay, you got the gi on now. Made weight. Made weight. 76.2. <laughs> no more featherweight. <laughs> no more featherweight. No more. <laughs> What happened? Um, a little bit of confusion between the top floor, the check, and the official weight. Because I was underweight on top and then I'm over here. so They're not going to let you compete? And we're still waiting for the final decision by Watanabe. Good luck. Yeah.
It's first time in uh, the Grand Slam event? Yes, first time in Japan. So you, you've obviously, you've been to a lot of jiu-jitsu tournaments in your life, but uh, tell me, what is it like to see an event like this? Uh, for me it's a really pleasure to see something like that, because I show how, how the sport grow. You know, the sport grows so much. It has, has a beautiful display about the how it grows the, the, the jiu-jitsu. Yeah, but uh, you're here, you're, you're with your dad teaching uh, jiu-jitsu in Japan, but you also have uh, you have something else that you yeah, want to show just, us as well, right? I just wrote a book, the first uh, dictionary of Brazilian jiu-jitsu ever. So I, I really recommend, you know, if you want to learn Portuguese or if you're a Brazilian want to learn English terms of jiu-jitsu, that, that's the book. Where can people find that? Uh, Amazon.com And so we search for... Respect. respect. That's how Brazilians pronounce uh, respect. You know, awesome. so. It's going to be good. It'll help a lot, man. Yeah, yeah. I hope so. That's... It is so busy in here. So busy. Hey, I got you a present. What did you get me? I got you this. A dictionary of Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. You say you want to learn Portuguese, right? Respect. Respect. <laughs> man, Crianche. How old tea? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> So the weigh-ins are over, some guys made it, some guys didn't unfortunately. They're putting the finishing touches on the arena now as you can see behind us. It's looking pretty good, it's ready to go for Sunday morning here at Tokyo local time. We're going to be there broadcasting it live, uploading every match to flowgrappling.com. You know where to go. See you there.